It's an incredible achievement, not just establishing something new to the county, but building it out to scale. San Diego County's mobile crisis response teams are making a big milestone, helping thousands of people dealing with a mental health crisis. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Steve Price in for Marcella. I'm Carlo Cicchetto. These specially trained teams launched three years ago, and as CBS 8's Richard Allen finds, they offer a targeted alternative to calling in armed law enforcement. Well, that's right. On a daily basis, local law enforcement in the county receive more than 100 calls for service for mental health related concerns, calls that can often be handled more effectively by mobile crisis response teams. It's best used as a prevention method. County Supervisor Tara Lawson Reamer highlights the success of San Diego's mobile crisis response teams, or MCRTs, in terms of what they help to avoid. It can actually lessen the chance that an individual ends up on our streets. These teams also help reduce the burden on local hospitals and emergency rooms, as well as on local law enforcement. Over 98% of calls have been diverted from armed law enforcement, resulting in a trained MCRT team arriving instead. That specialized team includes a mental health clinician, peer support specialist, and a case manager. CRT3 out. CBS 8 had the opportunity earlier to go out with a mobile crisis response team. Tell me about that. Who wants you dead? To see them in action. Are they an imminent risk to themselves or someone else? Is there a medical reason that they would need EMS services first? Um, do they have weapons on them? And if we clear all those criteria, then um, our team will accept the call. Since launching in 2021, MCRT has responded to over 13,000 calls. Nearly 8,000 San Diegans in crisis have been assisted by these highly trained teams, which can be dispatched to a home, business, or street location. MCRT is about access about prevention. Dr. Luke Bergman is director of San Diego County's Behavioral Health Services Department. The numbers behind this service make clear that it works, that it is significant at the population health level. Among those numbers, according to the county, are an average response time of 17 minutes. Also, more than half of all calls are successfully resolved in the field, with no need to transport the client to an ER or other service. On top of that, an untold number of Clients getting behavioral help early can help decrease the number of San Diegans experiencing homelessness. Because it can help folks manage their conditions before they end up on the streets. And keep in mind, if you or someone you know is in need of a mobile crisis response team, you can call 988.